I'm hungry. Deep River Limited Edition Ninja Ginger Potato Chips. A kettle-cooked snack sure to give your taste buds a kick. Thick cut with the sweet taste of ginger, chili pepper, and cilantro. Your good buddy DJ Clive here, and I've never heard of the Deep River Snack Company. I do like the name of this though, Ninja Ginger. Ninja Ginger. I have a stutter as it is. How do you expect me to say that again and again and again? Um, when it comes to spicy snacks, I've never been all out bowled over by one. Um, I've had a lot of, like you might remember the Takis review I did a while back. Um, they, they were a little spicy. I couldn't really eat too many of them without drinking water, but nothing really like nuclear hot. And I'm really searching for something that's nuclear hot. Something that's gonna tip me over out of my chair onto the floor, dying for water. Um, this has potential. It says that there's a sweet, savory, slightly spicy combination of ginger, chili pepper, and cilantro. Um, I love chili peppers, probably more than anyone you know. But let me take a whiff of this and see what it smells like. Wow, that's got a very, very cool, cool scent to it. It smells very, very Asian. Um, it's probably the ginger that I'm smelling. And you'll see that these chips look very, very crispy. If you'll note the texture of it in the light, um, it feels very, very hard in my hand. I can practically, if I try to, to rip it in half, can't do it. It's so freaking tough. This is gonna be an extremely crunchy chip. And you know what? To me, that kind of thing matters. It's gonna earn some brownie points. So anyway, I will stick it in my gullet and hopefully it will have me scrambling for some cold beverages. Boom, 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 boom. All right, it's not hot at all. It's it's barely even. If there was like a, a thermal scale scale of how hot this is, it wouldn't have any mercury in it. It would be like towards the bottom. It definitely has a unique spice though. I like the taste of it. It's got a really like. Whoever came up with the idea of combining these specific flavors together, this is a work of genius, because it's unlike anything I've ever tasted before. And as I said before, the crunch definitely helps. If I were to give this a star rating, I would give it three and a half stars. Still waiting for that snack to knock me out of my chair onto the floor scrambling for cold beverages. This is not the one. It's got a nice spice that I feel way, way in the back of my throat, and it is a little bit hot back there. But nothing that I'm gonna need to, to drink a, an Abita Purple Haze um, for. Man, you are so delicious. I would be a bastard if I kept all these for myself. Jilu! Hey, Creaky! Have you seen Jilu? Oh, there he is! Of course! Jilu loves it! Well, you know, I'd give you some, but that means I have to go into my editing programs and come up with a whole new title sequence, maybe even try to find another theme song and, you know, second or third opinion starring Squinkies. That requires more work and I'm a lazy fuck. You know, I'm gonna go in front of the boob tube right now and finish the rest of this while watching me some Captain N the Game Master or something. And until next time, hey, I'll see you in limbo.
Get these. They're not bad. They're pretty good. Oh, no. 